all like to learn and improve your self-confidence, let me hear you say yes loud. Yes. Yes. yes! Open your folders. At the very top, you'll see, how do you feel today? Okay. your self-confidence. Who would like to have more self-confidence? Show your hands. Okay, confidence is a basic skill. You, it can be learned. And uh, the way to have confidence is basically, in my view, to be aligned. Aligned meaning, do you know how sometimes you're thinking one thing, you're saying another, and you're doing another? Right? So I'm not going to have, you know, cake, chocolate cake, whatever. You say that, you think that, and you actually say to your friends, I'm on a diet, I'm not going to have chocolate cake. And then you see the chocolate cake and you go for it. Has that occurred to you, something similar? Show your hands. Would you all like to learn and improve your self-confidence? Let me hear you say yes loud. Yes! yes. yes. Open your folders. At the very top, you'll see. How do you feel today? Okay. Between below zero, 10, and plus 10, how are you feeling? No judgment, just how are you feeling? Because one of the first elements of self-confidence is self-awareness. To be aware, where am I? How am I feeling here and now? Not to get lost in your thought, but to really be grounded. How are you feeling now on a scale from 1 to 10? How much are you feeling now on a scale from plus 10 to 0? Yes, you please. Where are you feeling on that range? 6. 6, you feel a 6? Good. All right. And we hope to increase it by the end of the day. We hope to get it to plus 10. How about yourself? How are you feeling today? Below 10, plus 10. Most people, most of us, we have a thermostat. A thermostat. Which means, say you want a Lamborghini for some reason. You'll be very excited for one month or two, but studies have shown that you'll just go back to who you are, your thermostat, even after you won the Lamborghini. Do you know what I mean? Um, we tend to get where we are. So that's your thermostat. Now, we can rise our thermostat by getting rid of our baggage, emotional baggage. So you can improve your daily thermostat. Would you like to improve your daily thermostat? Show your hands. Who would like to improve their mood, their daily mood? Yes? Of course, we all like to improve our daily mood. Because in the end, it's not money or success or other things. It's how you feel inside. That's the quality of your life, how you're feeling inside. That's the real quality of your life. You know, all of you, you want success, career success, you want, you have big dreams, and that's fine, but I'm telling you from now, before you really get into your life, is that it's how you feel inside that is your real quality of life. Right? Am I mistaken? You're correct. Correct, right, yeah. There we go. Most people will tell you that. So, let's start with our first question. Could, who wants to read the first question? Would you like to read the first question? In one or two sentences, for example, you would get complaints to you. Right. In one or two sentences, write down your biggest complaint about your life. It could be anything. You know, I don't have enough money. My mother is a headache. Uh, I hate my house. I hate my boss. I don't know, what, what is depressing you lately? What is making you sad? I'm going to give you a few moments to write it down. As I said, we're doing inner work. I'll put some music for you. Remember, we're learning a method today, so you can go back to this method and do it deeper and deeper each time. But I'm going to teach you a way to process your problems and your emotional baggage. 
and to raise your self-confidence in this way. Would you like that? Does that sound interesting? Have you already written your thing? Okay. You're not, you don't have to share them with the group, but if you would like to share, to talk about it, not talk about it, just read the sentence. If anyone wants, if anyone is brave enough, I'll be happy to hear what you're frustrated about. Anybody want to share? What are you frustrated about? Sir? Yeah, I'm frustrated that I have to go back to France on Saturday. Okay. I'm frustrated that I have to go back to France. Well, you like it here in Greece. Okay. Yeah, it doesn't have to be life-altering. Just something that's frustrating. Your boss, your mother, your girlfriend. Who else wants to share? Who has the courage to share? I'm frustrated with my parents because they're getting old and I may have to take care of them. And I do have to take care of them. And I do have to take care of them. Excellent. These are, I want you to be real. Be real. This is not theory. This is your life. I'm giving you, I'm going to give you a, a, a fantastic tool. A tool that was actually inspired by Aristotle and Socrates to process your feelings. Thank you for watching up until now. If you'd like to see the rest of this video, the whole workshop of 40 minutes, please join as a member of Alkestis TV.